Hey, what's up guys? It's Ryan from My Listing Club. In this video, I'm gonna introduce you to a new add-on from the My Listing Club, and it's called the Flipping Boxes Listing Counter. I know it's a bit of a mouthful, but I think it is an accurate title for what this add-on does. And quick shout out to the My Listing Club Pro community for helping me name this. Uh, be sure to use your discount uh, to get 50% off, guys. Um, that is now through Monday, so it's it's, you can get this add on for as low as $5 now, uh, even cheaper, I think if you're a member, but, um, also because if you're watching this video, I'm going to extend the deal to you guys as well. So the coupon code is flip 50 F L I P 50 and get 50% off until Monday. Okay. All right. So let's dive in, uh, to what this, what this, uh, is all about. And, uh, we will see this firsthand on a, on a, uh, on my listing, working on a, my listing website. Okay, so from the My Listing Club website, that's mylisting.club, scroll down the homepage just a bit, click on My Listing Add-ons, and here we are looking at Flipping Boxes Listing Counter. So let's go into that. Let's quickly run through this, this product page here. So as it says at the top, we, we're going to show platform presence, advertise potential engagement, and encourage additional listings. Quickly what that means is, unless people know to go to the Explorer page and you know, see how many listings are there, kind of get a gauge of what's going on, or maybe some other, there are some other ways to display the number of listings on a site, but this just gives you another way. So let's say, for example, you're a job seeker and you're kind of like on the fence of whether to join this directory or not. And you go to add your listing and you've got that question in the back of your mind and you say, hey, there's uh, 5,000 employers listed on this website, or you flip it around, you're an employer thinking about listing on this site and you, you still got that question in the back of your mind. You go to add your listing and you see, hey, there's um, 2,000 people on here looking for jobs that have their resume posted and that sort of thing. Let's, let's definitely get our business on here. So that's what I mean by show platform presence, advertise potential engagement and encourage additional listings. Encourage those people to add more and more listings uh, or to the very minimum add their first one, okay? Um, so what this is going to do is going to show how many listings are currently published per listing type on the website by displaying a count within the listing type flipping boxes on the ad listing page. It's a mouthful. I'm going to show you this here in a second. Without this add on prospective listing owners have limited insight into the number of listings on your website. I've, I've already kind of explained that. Uh, but with this add on, you're letting listing owners know how active your directory is and how likely it is they will see a return on their investment by adding their own listings. Okay. So let's look at how this works. It's very simple. Um, buy the plugin, download it, install it. There's going to be a couple of tweaks that you optionally can make. This is not a requirement. It's going to work out of the box. I'm going to show you what, what I mean by that. And then step three, just enjoy it, providing perspective, uh, listing owners with more insight into your directory. This walkthrough, uh, this video we're doing uh, right here is gonna be posted here, but this is a quick screenshot here uh, to show you what the outcome is gonna be. And um, this is a very important part. This add-on came about because of the club's custom development service. So uh, I'm not gonna go to that page for now, but you can check that out on, on your own. But what this is, is a service that allows you to request custom development, and then I'm gonna try to help you get your money back. So this. Um, this customer, this add-on came about because this customer wanted the functionality that you're seeing within this add-on and, uh, they paid for it. We worked together to make it happen uh, with the club's developer, delivered it. And it's what you're seeing here. Okay. Um, so I highly recommend that you check that out. If, if you're skeptical, this is the pricing table switcher and this add-on are two that came from this service and there's more to come. So definitely check it out. Um, for example, if you want this add-on to do a little bit more than it does from after I show you what it does here in this video, you can jump on that custom development um, page and submit whatever you want it to do and we'll work through it, okay? Uh, because the, the original customer paid the bulk of the money to have this developed, which still was not that much money for being honest, um, but since they paid the bulk, you, you would just be paying for smaller tweaks if, if, if you're interested, okay? Um, Couple of FAQs I want to run through. Which my listing websites is this meant for? This add-on is meant for my listing websites that use the flipping boxes. We're going to see those in a second. This is how my listing works out of the box. It has these flipping boxes. I'll show you. 
How do I add this to my site? Super simple. Uh, I'm going to show you, but uh, install and activate the add-on. Um, edit the ad listing page. Um, you're going to edit the, the ad listing form widget. Put this CSID in here, which I'll show you, and save your changes. Okay. Um, how do I customize the text that's displayed? I've got um, nice and simple instructions for you here. You do not have to do this uh, unless you want to change the text. This is just an option, uh, but I'll show you how to do that. Okay. Um, support is offered in the My Listing Club Facebook group. This is a, a paying members only group. So I encourage you to, 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 to sign up. Um, if you're already a club member and you're paying for a membership, you might as well jump in there. Uh, it's, it's, it's active, tips are shared. Um, and I keep people updated on a lot of stuff. So definitely check that out. How is this licensed? You can use this on as many websites as you want that you, that you own. Uh, I just asked that if you install this on client websites, um, that you you purchase another uh, copy from me just to just to help support. Um, primarily, the person that had this developed, so they can help get their money back. You know, more so than than, than helping me out here. But um, by 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 doing the right thing as far as um, the licensing and making purchases for websites that are not yours. Um, you know, help support that person that made this add on, um, come about. Okay. All right. So enough jibber jabber. I'm going to pull this to my other screen. Um, so I can reference these instructions here. Pretty simple stuff though. All right. So let's get into the nitty gritty. This is a, uh, a demo of my listing website. Uh, if we go to plugins, we see that I have the plugin installed here, the my listing club, flipping boxes, listing counter. If we go to the front end of this website, Let's go to the ad listing page and let's refresh this. Okay, so we see out of the box, this is how this plugin is going to, what the text is gonna display. Five listings site-wide, three listings site-wide and two listings site-wide, okay? And LT1 is listing type one, listing type two and listing type three. So let's look at how this corresponds in the back end. So, Again, we've got five, three, and two. So if we go back here and we go to listings, we see LT1, let's sort these by name real quick, sorry. LT1, A, B, C, D, and E. So that's five, right? Going back to the front end, five listings under listing type one. And we'll just look at one more. Listing type two has three listings. So here we go. Listing type two, A, B, and C. So that's three and then three. So let's quickly add another um, for listing type two. So I'm just gonna clone this one. We're gonna call this listing uh, BD here, publish this. So this is gonna give us our third listing under listing type two, okay? So we now see, or sorry, wait a minute. I think I said that wrong. Hold on one second here. For our fourth listing. So we've got three now. You see how there's three now underneath there? We just did our fourth. So let's refresh this. There we go. So now we have four listings under there. So pretty cool stuff. All right, so how did we make that happen other than installing the plugin? And again, these instructions are on the product page, but I'm gonna show you, it's real simple. We're gonna go to the ad listing page. This is the core page that my listing uses for the ad listing. Uh, you can name it whatever you want. It just has to have this, this widget right here. It's the 27 um, ad listing form. Let me refresh this. Thank you, Elementor, for doing that. <laughs> okay, so edit the widget. Tw again, 27 ad listing form. We're going to go to the advanced tab. And under CSSID, we're just going to put in listing dash types and save our changes. That's all there is to it for that page. Okay. Now, um, the last piece is how to change the actual text here. So let's, I'm going to show you the, the right way and the wrong way. Um, there's no wrong, well, yeah, there's, I guess you call it wrong way. It's a more risky way, but it's, it's the faster way. So this first way I'm going to show you is not the way that I recommend, but I'm going to show you that you can do it this way. Okay. So you can go to plugins, plugin file editor, uh, select plugin to edit. We're gonna you know, choose this one, the flipping boxes. The file you're gonna edit is this, the JavaScript file here, okay? Um, by default, line 19 is the one that's active. And again, if I pull over the product page here, 
We see here line 19 is the default. So I say that's the default. And what this does is appends the words listings site wide after the number of listings, which we can confirm here. Five listings site wide. Okay. So I'm saying here in the instructions, if you want to change that, you're going to change line 18. And I tell you how to do that. Real simple. Okay. From this editor, you're going to just put two these two dashes in front. That that that's what we call, you know, developers call commenting out that line. That means it's not going to function. Okay. Now we need to remove them from this line, which makes it active. Okay. And we're going to save these changes. What this option does, as it shows on the product page, option line 18, this is going to prepend. It's going to add, meaning it's going to add the word currently before the number of listings and to then append listings dash site wide. Okay. So I'm going to duplicate this tab here. Okay. We're going to see this change. So right now it says five listings site wide. It's going to now say currently five listings site wide. So let's refresh this. There we go. Currently five listings site wide, whereas before just said five listings site wide. So it totally just it depends on what you want to say here. This can be whatever you want. Um, you just edit this file, you know, as as you want. You could say instead of um, currently, you could say uh, funny. Okay, let's put the word funny in there in all caps, and let's refresh that. Okay. Funny five listings site-wide, or you can come in here and you could say, uh, you know, funny five listings on this site. Refresh that. There we go. Funny five listings on this site. You know, you can, whatever you want to come up with, you can do. And it's just, it's just that simple. Okay. Um, Trying to think if I'm missing anything or if that about about covers it. Yeah. So again, if if maybe I mentioned this already, I can't remember. But flip fifty f i l p fifty that'll get you fifty percent off of this add on through Monday. So take advantage of that. You can get this thing as low as five dollars, even more. Even lower, I think, if you are a club member, depending on your level of membership. But yeah, uh, excited about this. Excited that it came about because of the custom development service. It just shows that it, how it is working. Um, and I encourage more people to use that service. And I hope you get uh, some use out of this this um, this add-on and hope it helps you guys. So uh, please click subscribe so you know when the next video comes out and the next product, next service, whatever from the club. All right. Thanks, guys. And catch you on the next one.